please describe your job title and primary duties. I guess you can call it a the floor consultant. Um, what we did was mostly uh, interacting with the customers, um, making sure that you know they were taken care of. So if they were looking for something particular, directing to where that is, helping them find sizes, um, directing to the change rooms, you know, making sure that they're, I guess, happy. <laughs> um, we did do all depending on, I guess, um, how well you were at. Uh, I guess taking direction and um, your responsibility, you would be able to do cash, but mostly you started off with like at the floor folding, NCO, so making sure like all the sizes were in uh, chronological order. What was the work environment like? There, it wasn't too bad. Um, they do try to promote a like a friendly type of environment um, where not too much to the point where, you know, you forget who's your boss and, like, you know, who's supposed to be higher up, like, who's your manager, you're supposed to be the subordinates, how, like, you know, the hierarchy is supposed to go. Um, but they still try to promote a friendly environment where, you know, everyone got along with each other, um, not a lot of animosity going on. How would you describe the application and interview process? I did... Um, I did a walk-in, I guess you could say, walk-in um, application process. So I gave her my resume, and she called me back. And uh, how they do their interviews, they don't do it in the store. They do it outside the store on a bench. <laughs> um, it lasted for about, I'd say, maybe like 20, 25 minutes or so. And she basically answered like generic questions that any entry level would be. So like, you know, um, what were the last jobs that you worked at? Did you enjoy it there? Um, if uh, you were presented with this problem, how did you go about it? Um, do you have a problem with working with difficult people? So, yeah. What other advice would you give to a job seeker looking to get employment? Just be yourself, make sure that you're honest, um, try to research as much as possible of the company that you are applying. So when I did do my interview, I made sure I went online to find out exactly, okay, what was it that Susie Shield was about? What other chains that they did have? Was there something new that or innovative that they were doing that in the industry that was setting them apart from all the other ones? Just so that when I came to the interview process, I the type of questions, that because at the end they do ask you, do you have any questions? So the type of questions that I asked them seemed as though, you know what, I really did my homework and I really was interested in actually being there.